Hey, little Bill and Dora, we are all going to the movies to see Frozen 2 because we all wanted to see that movie. But, Bowser Jr. and company, we hate Frozen, besides, Disney movies suck. Yeah, I agree with Dora, we want to see the Wild Thornberrys movie instead. Little Bill and Dora, we are not seeing the Wild Thornberrys movie today. We are seeing Frozen 2 and it's final. Either you come with us, or else, you will be grounded big time. Let's go. Well, Tails, I wonder where our friends are? Well, they might be coming. Hello boys, what's up? Hello there boys and girls, what's up? Oh, nothing much. We are about to go see Frozen 2. Wanna join? Yes. So, let's go fellows. Awesome. Let's go. You know Dora, it's going to be trash. I know, right? Hey, Knuckles, have you seen my ears wiggle like a kung fu guy? Um, I haven't seen your ears wiggle before. I wanna see it. It's cool. Well, okay then. Watch this. Watch my ears. They are wiggling slowly. Wow. Mario. You are so cool that you'd wiggle your ears like a kung fu guy. That's so awesome. I know, right? Do you think my ears are big? Look. Um, yes. They're a little big. That's also cool that you'd wiggle your ears back and forth. Also, you can also move your each ear. Of course. Wanna see my right ear move? Watch. Whoa. Mario dude. Your right ear is moving forward. That's so awesome. Yeah. That's so cool. HM. I never seen such a thing Mario. But, it's so cool. Anyways guys. The adverts are starting right away. McDonald's invites you to play the Disney Video Masterpiece Collection Trivia Challenge. The biggest trivia game ever at McDonald's. Pick the right answer to questions about Disney Masterpiece Collection videos and win every time. Over 300 million prizes, like a vacation to Walt Disney World, hot McDonald's food, Disney books from Mouseworks, Come play today. It's going to be magic. Mm, 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 mm. Hey, honey, what you got there? Popcorn from Dairy Queen. Want to try? Sure. Mm. It's good, huh? Hey, wait a second. What, what, what? This isn't popcorn, you idiot. It's popcorn shrimp! Oh, oh, I knew there was something familiar about it. Hold on. Where are the kids? <laughs> The DQ Popcorn Shrimp Basket. So good, shrimp would eat them. Nothing says loving like my chocolate chip cookies. Here you go, boy. Wow! Cookies! Who put this back empty? I, I didn't drink it. <laughs> cookies? Did you drink it? <laughs> Me? Oh, oh, no. um, oh boy. Don't jump, fat boy! Oh, see, I, um... Got milk. 
A little drum music, if you please. Get ready for the hippest tape of them all. Look out, you beauties. Here comes Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong Country, Legend of the Crystal Coconut. I can't believe I gave the Crystal Coconut to a couple of the bad guys. Arr, all I want to do is get me booty back to fend my honor with loot and lies. It's the first feature-length 3D animated adventure based on the enormously popular Nintendo game that took an entire generation by storm. Well, blow me down! <laughs> this is no wimpy fairy tale. It's a search for the truth. A battle between good and evil. A quest for supreme power. This adventure could only happen in a thriller of a gorilla, Donkey Kong. And now you can see it on video. Everyone is after it. Featuring all of your favorite characters, Cranky <laughs> Kong, Diddy, King Cruel, Captain Scurvy, and of course, Donkey Kong. You want it? You got it. Donkey Kong Country Legend of the Crystal Coconut is filled with action, humor, and eight unforgettable funky hip-hop songs. We gotta get the coconut back! Again! So get ready, you'll go bananas for Donkey Kong Country Legend of the Crystal Coconut. Sounds to me like you've lost your coconut. Wow, these are some cool adverts. Even with the McDonald's commercial, the one with dopey wiggling his ears. Eerie, isn't it? Yeah, it is, Fennec and Flame Boy. Hmm, that's strange when a dopey dwarf wiggled his ears with diamond eyes. Yeah, that dopey scene makes me wanna wiggle my ears. But, anyways, the previews are starting right away girls and boys. Yeah, that dopey scene made my ears wiggle too. Yeah. Myers were wiggling too when I saw Adobe wiggling his ears. And the previews are starting right away, people. Within the uncharted depths of waters surrounding a group of islands off the 50th parallel lies man's most formidable challenge. The awesome awakening of prehistoric monsters long thought extinct. Savage and deadly. Their one hope is to rule our planet as they once had thousands of years back. Giant against giant. The ultimate battle. Godzilla versus Megalon. Science was baffled and powerless. A terror-stricken humanity knew that it was on the brink of total destruction. A once proud civilization now had to place its trust and hope in Godzilla and his powerful ally, Robot Man. In concert, they would fight this evil in a duel to the death. Battling by day, battling by night, it was more than a race against time. This war was an all-out effort whose ultimate purpose was to save our planet from total destruction. Now came the moment of truth. The ultimate battle. Titan against Titan. Giant against giant in the most spectacular battle yet. You'll see it all in Godzilla versus Megalon.
In this quiet neighborhood. On this tranquil street. A mystery is unfolding. And an adventure is beginning. Again. I'm keeping you. In March 2002, Steven Spielberg's masterpiece returns to theaters everywhere. What's he doing? E.T. Phone home. E.T. Phone home. Like you've never experienced it before. <laughs> With enhanced visual effects. Never before seen footage. And a digitally remastered soundtrack. <laughs> Next spring, take the journey. What are you waiting for? Let's go! And experience the excitement as E.T. returns home to the big screen for a new generation to discover what the rest of us <laughs> will never forget. Steven Spielberg presents the 20th anniversary of E.T. the Extraterrestrial. I'll be right here. the surface of our planet they're getting ready for battle but one soldier is marching to a different tune sacrifice to some it is just a word to others it is a code Jeez, you know i'm really bad at word games <laughs> a soldier knows that the life of an individual ant doesn't matter what matters is the colony he's willing to live for the colony to fight for the colony to die for the colony. This guy's crazy. <laughs> I hear you. At 0800 hours, we receive word that the termite enemy has mobilized. We have no choice but to launch a preemptive strike. I am proud to send you into battle. Into... I'm, so, I'm sorry, into battle? Dismiss. Left face. Forward march. Yeah, I, you know, I think there's been a terrible mistake. I, you know, <clears throat> the truth is, I, I just I just came for the speech. Don't worry, kid. I'll watch out for you. Sound off. One, two. Sound off. Three. Huh? The ants go marching one by one. Hurrah. Hurrah. We slaughter termites just for fun. Hurrah. Hurrah. So, these, these termites, they're, they're, these guys are not going to put up much of a fight, right? I mean, we're talking about pushovers, right? Not really, kid. They're five times our size. And they shoot acid from their foreheads. Hey, keep it moving, Shorty. We'll all be dead before we're through. Hurrah! Hurrah! See, what, exactly what does our platoon do? I mean, you, you know, are we going to be serving beverages or, or processing paperwork? Our platoon or... has the best assignment of all. We're the first into battle. Hey, fellas, that's, you're being a little extreme, I feel. Why, why, don't, why don't we just try and influence their political process with campaign contributions? Come on! Let's get some termite ass! Over the top! Yeah! DreamWorks Animation and BDI present Ants. years ago I fought my way out of that cave became Iron Man realized I loved you I know I said no more surprises but I was really hoping to pull off one last one 
The world has changed. None of us can go back. All we can do is our best. And sometimes the best that we can do is to start over. All these people die. I keep telling everybody they should move on. Some do, but not us. Even if there's a small chance, we owe this to everyone who's not in this room to try. We will. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. like this one. <laughs> Miles! Yeah? Gotta go! If you want me to drive you, we gotta go no, now. Dad. I'll walk. Personal chauffeur going once. It's okay. <laughs> Seriously, Dad, walking would have been fine. Breaking news, Spider-Man saves the day again. Spider-Man. This guy swings in, wants the day, zip zap zop Nancy. Oh, no. yeah, Accountability. Speed up, speed up. You know, I know these kids. Yo, Miles, man, you get arrested? Guys, don't cops run red lights? Well, yes, some do. But, uh, not your dad. In your universe, there's only one Spider-Man. But there is another universe. It looks and sounds like yours, but it's not. My name's Miles Morales. Hey, kid. You're like me. How? I knew my day would come around this time. I know it's complicated. Just had to get my soul and free my mind. You want to know what happened to you? I can teach you to be Spider Man. Mm, I love this burger. So delicious. Mm, one of the best burgers I've ever had. You have money, right? I'm not very liquid right now. I think you're going to be a bad teacher. How am I supposed to save the whole world? You can't think about saving the world. You have to think about saving one person. One thing I know for sure, don't do it like me. Do it like you. Brooklyn! Who's gonna stop us now? Hey, I'm all in, I'm all in. I ain't worried about a loss or a new friend. Never worried about a fraud or a new bitch. Lost love, I ain't worried about a fraud. I see the spark in you. It's amazing. Hands up! Whatever you choose to do with it, you'll be great. I love you, Miles. Yeah, I know, Dad. <laughs> you gotta say I love you back. Dad, are you serious? I, I wanna hear it. You wanna hear me I say it? I love you, Dad. You're dropping me I off out of school? I love you, Dad. Look at this place. Dad, I love you. Dad, I love you. That's, That's a copy. copy. Time to swing, just like I taught you. When did you teach me that? I didn't. It's a little joke for team building. Hey, guys. OK, who are you? I'm Gwen Stacy. Come on. How many more spider people are there? Save us at Comic-Con. What's Comic-Con? Let's go! Whoa. I'm Sonic, a little ball of super energy in an extremely handsome package. On my planet, people were always after my powers. So I came to yours. It gets a little lonely, but that's okay. I am living my best life on Earth. What? Ow! 
that the plate Sonic. That the pitcher's mound also Sonic. Ugh, I can't with that guy. Uh-oh. Uh... Super Sonic! Why are you hiding out in my garage? They're coming for me! If they steal my power, they could conquer the universe. You have to help me. No, I don't. Please, it's life or death. Super Sonic! Good morning, my rural chum. Mr. Dr. Robotnik. I'm going to give you five seconds to tell me where it is. Wait, don't hurt him. <laughs> Road trip, woo -woo. This can't be happening to me. Oh my God, stop the car right what? now. What? The world's largest rubber band ball? We gotta see it. No, this is not some fun family road trip. <laughs> eh, you're right, it was lame. Gift shop was cool though. Whatever this creature is, I'm going to uncover the source of its power. Yeah, hey. Ah! I just thought you might like a latte with steamed Austrian goat milk. Of course I want a latte. I love the way you make them! We gotta lay low. Let me show you how it's done. Hey, hey. So should we get out of here? Yeah, time to go. I always want to do this. Nailed it! Uh-oh. Let's go! Here comes the boom! How are you not dead? I have no idea! Oh! Give me a big fat break! That was an illegal left, by the way. Oh, this one is cute. Let's keep him. Oh, come on! You've got car insurance, right? Why would you throw your life away for this silly little alien? Good time. He's my friend. Let's go! This is my power. And I'm using it to protect my friends. Let's go! Let's go! So, you're supposed to be Tom's best friend that he won't shut up about. Well, I don't see the appeal. That is very gross. Let's go. I'd like to make an announcement. Hogwarts Castle will not only be your home this year, but home to some very special guests as well. Please welcome our friends from the north, the proud sons of Dobstrang. And now, the lovely ladies of Bo Battens. I was just wondering if maybe you wanted to go to the ball with me. Mr. Weasley, place your right hand on my waist. Where? Is that Hermione Granger with Victor Crumb? You're fraternizing with the enemy. The enemy? Hogwarts has been chosen to host a legendary event, the Triwizard Tournament. And now, the champion selection, Victor Crump, Fleur Delacour, Cedric Diggory, <laughs> Harry Potter! How did you do? I didn't put my name in that cup. I don't want eternal glory. It's not our mood, Father Kedavra. The killing curse. Only one person is known to have survived it, and he's sitting in this room. People die in this tournament. The devils are inside the walls. Something's coming closer. I can feel it. The Dark Lord shall rise again. Is it Voldemort?
These are some cool previews. The new Sonic the Hedgehog movie is going to be cool. I know, right? Even better than the first trailer because that first trailer of Sonic looks more like the Grinch alien to me. Yeah! The first trailer of you, Sonic, you look like the Grinch alien. Well, I really don't like the first trailer of my movie. The second trailer rocks, because, the character design just looks like me. More similar to my games. Yeah! Buddy you rock. The movie is starting right away boys. Wow, that was an awesome movie. I know, right? You know, little Bill, this movie sucks. The first one is the worst. I know, right? Hey, Dora, how about we ditch from Frozen 2 to see the Wild Thornberries movie? That's a great idea, little Bill. Let's go. Hey, guys, we need to use the restroom. Okay, but hurry back. The movie is about 45 minutes left. You don't want to miss the rest of the movie. And then, come right back. Thanks guys. We'll be right back. Hey, little Bill, let's go ditch from Frozen 2 to see the Wild Thornberries movie. That's especially an awesome idea Dora, let's go. Hey, Dora. We did it without being caught to see the Wild Thornberries movie. I know, we made it. So, the previews are starting right away, Little Bill. Deep beneath the world's greatest ocean lives a sponge unlike any other. Hooray! Bubble party! For years, he enjoyed a carefree life. Hey! Who blew this bubble? But all that was about to change. By tomorrow, I will rule! The world! <laughs> well, good luck with that. My crown! <laughs> Someone has stolen the royal crown! <laughs> Who can stop me now? <laughs> you, be back here with my crown in exactly ten days. He can do it in nine, eight, seven, six, 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 six it is then. Now, what is it? The paddy wagon. Sesame seed finish. Steel belted pickles. And under the hood? Wow. Yeah. Wow. We will begin a journey to become the hero he was born to be. Are they laughing at us? No, Patrick. They're laughing next to us. This November. Hooray for SpongeBob! <laughs> Get ready. Let's get it out! Go for a big adventure. Oh boy. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> big trouble. Things have gotten a lot worse since you left. Plankins turned everyone we know into slaves. Even Gary. Meow, Plankton. Big twists. Oh my gosh, Patrick, you have a mustache! So do you! Oh. And big surprises when Sponge meets World. Who are you? I'm David Hasselhoff. For the very first time. Hooray! The SpongeBob SquarePants movie. It's one of the most beloved animated classics of all time. I wish I was a boy. 
Is that you, dear blue fairy? But that's another movie. Ow, you're hurting me, dear blue fairy. How many times I gotta tell you, dog breath, I ain't no fairy! Coming only to theaters. Is it really you? In the fur! Disney's Teacher's Pet. World, here I come! I gotta be a boy! The musical tale of a dreamer. Him with the dream again. It's not enough you dress up like a boy and go to that cockamamie school every day. Who is so over being Rover. Be a good doggy. This really stinks. You should smell it from down here. Whoa! Until one day... Dr. Ivan Crank claims he can turn animals into dumb human beings just like you. It's my dream come true. Now he's taking a chance. I've got to meet that man. And unleashing the power of his inner boy. Spot! Who is that? He looked a lot shorter on TV. Maybe it's the axe. I shall make you a boy. Oh, that is just wrong on so many levels. A boy needs a... Coming only to theaters. Disney's Teacher's Pet. He's good. I wish I had a nickel for every time I've heard that. Century Fox invites you to take an advanced peek at the biggest holiday event of 1994. Starring Macaulay Culkin as you've never seen him before. In the world of Richard Tyler, danger is everywhere. Ah! Look, it's Richard Tyler. Go for it, Tyler. What's wrong? You scared? Hey, Rich, come on up. Solid as a rock. 8% of all household accidents involve ladders. Another 3% involve trees. We're looking at 11% probability here. Go down to Gutman's hardware store, buy a pound of nails. We're going to finish this treehouse before dark if it kills us. Under the rain. And into a place where imagination runs wild. Welcome, young man. The library hard, please. I don't have one. You do now. Get ready for the adventure of a lifetime with the Page Master. I'm a cartoon. You are an illustration. Ah! Right now, he's only a drawing, while the most magical film of 1994 is in production. The Shibbles! Featuring the voices of Whoopi Goldberg. Oh, baby. Patrick Stewart. Ah! I ain't afraid! Frank Welker from Aladdin. <laughs> Leonard Nimoy. Dr. Jekyll? Yes, sir. And Christopher Lloyd. I am the page master. Producer David Kirshner, who brought you an American tale, Once Upon a Forest and Hocus Pocus, joins director Joe Johnston of Honey, I Shrunk the Kids, and the world's most creative animation designers to bring you an incredible world where Richard Tyler must conquer his own fears. Hang on, guys! I'm coming! That's it, boy! Go for the gizzard! My hero. The motion picture experience that will open your eyes to all the treasures the imagination can hold. The Page Master. Coming for Christmas 1994. The Naked Ape, is it you? From the worldwide bestseller by Desmond Morris, some startling answers. Hey, Sergeant, did you know that your facial and vocal expressions were developed by the hunting ape more than two million years ago? <laughs> the naked truth about you, man. Can you take it? No monkeys and apes don't fall in love. I keep forgetting. You know, we could be arrested. We? It's your fantasy. It's the naked truth about love. Courtship. Cheating. The raw basic drives under the veneer. The naked truth about jealousy. 
violence. And the laugh's on you. It's quite wild, part of the old reward system. Do you understand? I do. Well, I, I don't. Finger paint me I'll finger paint you peek behind civilization's fig leaf. The naked ape is only human. What are we gonna do? I got an idea. Go! Faster! Dumb. A person lacking mental power. What's her last name? I'll look it up. Starts with an S. S Slappy. No. Swap. Swappy. Nah. Maybe it's on the briefcase. Look on the. Oh yeah! It's right here. Samsonite. I was way off. Idiot. An adult mentally inferior to a child of three. Skis, huh? That's right. The years? Uh huh. Both of them? Yeah. Cool. Stupid, a person below normal intelligence. Hey, wanna hear the most annoying sound in the world? Guys! 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 If they each had half a brain, they'd still only have half a brain. Oh look, Frost. Hmm? Horror! Jim Carrey. Hold that plane! Sir, you, you can't go in there! It's okay! I'm the limo driver! Woo! <laughs> Jeff Daniels. Oh. oh, geez, look at the butt on that. Yeah. He must work out. Dumb. And dumber. <laughs> For these guys, every day is a no-brainer. It was the best of times. They were the best of friends. They made the best of memories. Why don't you go somewhere? Go play some man. Those cool, cool days. <laughs> Coolie high. Batman speaking. Warning all of you to brace yourselves for big news. The biggest. Tell them, Robin. Holy superlatives, Batman. It's really exciting. Soon, very soon, Batman and I will be batapulting right out of your TV sets and onto your theater screens. That's right, Robin. Our first full-length motion picture feature in color opens a whole new world of thrills. <laughs> The big screen gives us more space on land, sea, and in the air to challenge the most bataclysmic collection of super criminals ever. Their minimum objective must be the entire world. And here are the dastardly villains, the Catwoman. Oh. 
Oh, you're going to see the perfect crime when I get Batman in my claws. The Joker. Have you heard this one? It'll kill you, Batman. <laughs> the Penguin. There are two eggs this wily bird is going to scramble. Batman and Robin. <laughs> the Riddler. Question. Who's going to make the feathers fly and knock Batman and Robin out of the sky? See, the new weapons in the Bat Arsenal combat the forces of evil. The Batcopter. The exploding man-eating shark. Holy sardine! The relentless Megaton Magnet. The unholy quartet secret submarine. Fire on! Fire on! The Batboat, for an action. The Deadly Disintegrator. The attack on the Batcave. Holy hallucination! You'll blast through the skies on these mad, manned missiles. And you'll be with me, Robin, at the Bat Scanner, eavesdropping on Batman's romance. And you'll shudder at the death dealing Polaris missiles. Brace yourself, Robin. This could be the end. And that's just a sample of the exciting exploits ahead in our first feature motion picture. Holy memoranda, folks. Make a note not to miss it. Good thinking, Robin. <laughs> Well, I wonder where Dora and Little Bill are. Well, they must be in the bathroom, but, no. They ditched from Frozen 2 to the Wild Thornberry's movie. You know Sonic, they should be punished for that. How about you four, Pac-Man, Detective Pikachu, Fennec and Flame Boy and Super Jabin and Castro, punish Dora and Little Bill. The rest of you boys, we go home. See you boys later. So long Sega and Nintendo Heroes. Say, how about we punish these Nick Jr. troublemakers? Let's move it, buds. Well, I wonder where Plat Trapper where he is. Well, hello, fellows. What the hell is up? Well, hello, Plat Trap. What's up? Oh, nothing much. What's the news? Here's the news for you. Dora and Little Bill ditched from Frozen 2 to see the Wild Thornberry's movie. How about we go punish these Nickelodeon troublemakers this time? Alright mates, let's go punish Dora and Little Bill. Aha, uh -huh. my eyes are on the movie, and Dora and Little Bill, did you see that? Yeah boys, let's all punish these troublemakers at last. Wow, that was better than Disney's Frozen. I know, right? Oh no. It's the good guys. That's right, Dora and Little Bill. How are you ditched from Frozen 2 to see the Wild Thornberry's movie? You know that movie is made by Viacom. That's so it. We're going home right now. And also, you are getting beaten up by Wario and Shadow the Hedgehog when we get home. You two kids are going to be beaten up by Wario and Shadow the Hedgehog. Sonic, call Wario and Shadow to beat Little Bill and Dora up. Roger that, Fennec and Flame Boy. Hello, Dora and Little Bill. I'm Shadow the Hedgehog.
and I'm Warrior, and we are here to beat you two up. Warrior went Shadow the Hedgehog, wiggle your ears like a Kung Fu guy, then beat them up, you hear me? Okay. We'll wiggle our ears like a Kung Fu guy from the Master of the Flying Guillotine. Let's wiggle our ears. Yeah. Great job wiggling your ears, Wario and Shadow. Wow. These guys are awesome. Now. Beat them up. Now. Go to your room right now and think about what you did. We are calling your parents to ground you. Awesome job you guys. We just grounded Dora and Little Bill. Later on, we'll send them to the BND of Doom logos for their punishment. Great job. Wow. Mario, I've never seen your eye winked and wiggled your ears. Cool. Awesome. So, how about we... Oh my god. Metal Mario, what the heck do you think you are doing here? I'm Metal Mario, and I'm going to beat you up. Looks like we got to escape, right? Yeah! Are his ears starting to wiggle like the master of the flying guillotine? Yeah, I think so. His ears are starting to wiggle. Look. He's wiggling his ears right now. Uh oh. We're doomed. Let's leave now. Thank you. 